This home in Fort Worth stood for decades. I felt a deep sense of sadness by looking at this. But it was swallowed up by flames in a matter of seconds. It was like somebody hit me in the face. You know, like that. Kenneth Spencer grew up across the street from the home that caught on fire Monday evening. All these people in this area are pretty shocked. The pictures show crews fighting the blazing flames. But what you can't hear is the distress call made after the conditions rapidly changed. Mayday, mayday, mayday. Before the fire falls in the roof, from the side. It happened as they were trying to escape from the second floor window. Last night there were three different families that got that phone call that you hope that never has to be made. Craig Trojek with Fort Worth Fire says a captain, a lieutenant, and a firefighter were injured. One fell through the roof of this carport, and they were all rushed to the Parkland Hospital in Dallas. Two were back at home, recovering at home, uh, and we've got one brother of ours left, and we're going to make sure he gets out of there as, as quick as we can. Trojek says they're all veterans of the department, nearly 60 years of combined experience. And he's talked to the wife of the firefighter still in the hospital. He's got family uh, that are up there with him. They said he's basically he's been up since it happened. Family, these men hope to come home to every day, every night, doing a job they know is dangerous. It's good that they are alive. In Fort Worth, I'm Richard Saunders.